Welcome to my personal crew quarters on board the International Space Station. This is where I sleep. This is where I send emails from, talk to my family. This is where I have some personal space. But it's also where I'm testing one of the technologies of my Hugen mission, more specifically a circadian light panel. The idea is that a light panel like this can help regulate our day-night cycle, our circadian rhythm on board the International Space Station, which will make us sleep better. And through the better sleep, it'll make us uh, more energetic during the day. It'll increase our cognitive abilities, our abilities to concentrate, our reaction times will improve. In general, our mental state will be vastly improved through better sleep cycles, and through a better overall circadian rhythm. Sega Space Architects, a uh, company in Denmark, has developed a light panel which attempts to mimic uh, the changing uh, color of the sun's light during a 24-hour period. Right now it's the middle of the day and so the light panel is emitting white light. But I can put it on a uh, demonstration cycle that'll imitate the 24 hours in just a couple minutes to demonstrate uh, the changing or the fluctuation in the color of the light. So obviously when it's night the light panel is off, it's dark and I'm sleeping, uh, but as we approach the morning, say 5 a.m., 6 a.m., the light panel will automatically turn on, uh, but very very softly and in a, in a reddish glow and that mimics the natural sunrise on Earth. And as you can see, it's starting to come now. It quickly switches over to bright white light, uh, again, mimicking the rising sun. And this is the color of the light for most of the day. And then towards the evening, uh, it'll again shift uh, to a different wavelength um, and begin to dim itself automatically again simulating the setting sun. And as you can see, we're now approaching night. It's turning more yellowish, slightly reddish and dimming uh, by itself until it gets to about uh, 10 uh, p.m. in which case the light will completely extinguish and it'll be time for me to go to bed again. Very interesting technology that can uh, vastly improve the life of astronauts on board the International Space Station and on future deep space missions.